got this guy? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go hit him. It's pretty fun. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. out my car. Oh, it's sucking it right out. Yeah. Yeah, stack up your own Yeah. Dang. The Sir Tools B90 kit allows you to replace uh, the wheel bearings on your Porsche 928 in just a few hours. The kit can be purchased as either a master kit for servicing many makes of automobiles or as a specific BMW Porsche kit which has all the components you'll need to work on your 928. If you have the B90 master kit you will just need a few of the components from it and those are the number 13 installer number 14 extractor washer number 5 support disc number 4 spacer number 11 adapter sleeve number 3 extractor bracket with its long bolt and thrust bearing number 3J the uh, horseshoe and number 2 the elongated nut these parts are assembled in different ways depending on the task here is shown the configuration for pulling the hub, which is the first major task using this kit. Uh, here you see the bracket number 3, the horseshoe 3J, the long bolt, which will go through the center of the hub with its uh, thrust bearing, and then on the inside of the hub you would put the elongated nut. Uh, the nut is screwed down uh, and in position and held with a uh, 27 millimeter wrench while you turn the other end of the bolt with a 24 millimeter wrench. Uh, this image shows the configuration used to pull the wheel bearing. The only difference between this and the hub uh, pulling configuration is that the installer number 13 is inserted on the bolt before the elongated nut is screwed down. The instructions for the SIR tool kit show using extractor washer number 14. This is a smaller fitting that would only push on the inner race. Uh, this will work just fine. Uh, we use the larger installer fitting which pushes both on the race and on the outer shell of the bearing. The configuration used to install the bearing no longer uses the bracket 3 or the horseshoe 3J. Uh, and if you'll uh, look closely, you'll notice that the uh, bolt is reversed so that the elongated nut is now on the right side of the image and the um, thrust bearing end of the bolt is on the, the left side, which would be, and in this case, would be the inside of the car. So uh, we'd be pulling the bearing in from the right side and moving from the right side in the image, you'll see the installer number 13 and then the bearing then uh, this would be placed on uh, one side of the hub carrier and on the other side would be the spacer number four and the um, support disc number five uh, so that on the outside of the uh, car uh, you'd use a 27 millimeter wrench to hold the elongated nut and you'd use a 24 millimeter wrench on the inside to tighten down the bolt and pull the bearing in. The number four spacer fits rather nicely on the inside of the hub carrier and centers well uh, and this helps to draw the bearing in squarely however as you draw the bearing in you need to be careful to observe uh, that it doesn't uh, get cocked to one side and stuck in the uh, hub carrier. This image shows the final configuration, the one used to pull the hub back through the bearing and into the hub carrier. Uh, and it consists of the long bolt with the thrust bearing to the outside, then support disc number five, uh, which would be pushing against the outside of the hub. And on the inside of the hub, we would uh, have uh, installer 13. Uh, and then finally the elongated nut and so you would hold the elongated nut on the inside uh, while someone on the outside turns the um, the head of the of the bolt with a 24 millimeter wrench now also shown in this image is the 14 millimeter extractor uh, and that's what Sir Tools called for to be used that would uh, uh, be against the inner race but we use the installer since it's more self-centering inside the the hub carrier and uh, also note that 
these are positioned so that the inner flange faces away from the bearing rather than fitting up inside the bearing. Uh, if it fit up inside the bearing, it would stop the hub from going all the way uh, into the bearing as far as it needs to go.